Hello, um, and this is another Saturday wrap. This is Saturday the 11th of July 2020. And I have to say, where has the time gone? Anyway, this is a look back on the last week. Um, tech, beer and satire. And maybe a little bit of food as well. Anyway, so last Saturday, my mushroom kit actually sprang into life and the mushrooms started to grow. Um, they are chestnut mushrooms, slightly dark, slightly tasty, really good. And by Tuesday, um, I was eating them, which was a bit of a shame because I'd bought some in uh, Aldi on Monday night. Still, priority to those that I've grown. And they're still growing now. Um, you need to water them every night. I've got a little um, to keep them damp. Ooh, um, Dean, drinking your beer. I'm not sure it's like Bengali. It's quite complex, a little bit sweet, a little bit fruity, a little bit tingly, and a long lingering bitter fruity finish. B plus and a bit, not bad. And good in Germany, Prost. Anyway, so talking of beer, um, pubs in England opened on Saturday. There were a number of problems, um, mainly in London, everyone going completely crazy and three had to shut because of um covid however based on all of that um i think it was a little bit of a success and retired martin is traveling around and blogging again um wearing a mask i now have five masks my daily tech news show mask arrived on i think it was wednesday and I tweeted Tom Merritt and the show, and um, Tom retweeted it, and it's been my biggest ever tweet ever. I think it's up to about 4,000 views at the moment, which is, for me, somewhat of a minor miracle. So, when the pubs open properly in Wales, and what do I mean by that? On Monday, Monday the 13th, pubs in Wales... You can go to them, but you can only drink in beer gardens. Now, if you know Wales, you know it rains a lot. And to prove me wrong, the weather forecast for Monday and next week is dry and sunny. Somewhat, somewhat summery. Although the cricket was on this week <laughs> uh, down in Southampton, uh, England, although it's the England and Wales Cricket Board and Glamorgan Cricket Club should be renamed the Welsh Cricket Club because they play all the way from Glamorgan, Swansea and up to Colwyn Bay. Um, it rained, it rained a lot, although it's cheered up today. Tomorrow is even better and next week looks, depending on the weather forecast, a little bit spring-like. Not exactly boiling hot, but not raining, which I consider to be a positive. So, Monday... The five miles, that's as far as you can travel for leisure thing, disappeared. So you can go anywhere. And that let me start. Started planning things. Um, the Pelican in Gloucester still shut. I think Johnny in the Hereford Beer House, he's going to be shut until, well, shut for sitting in, although he does deliveries uh, until August. Um, much like Welsh beer, um, Welsh beer, Welsh pubs, they aren't opening for indoors until August the 3rd, so everything is rather pending at the moment. Um, and I've created a Twitter list full of pubs and places and things like Travel Lodge and Premier Inn to keep me up to date on all those sorts of things. Um, I use Better Tweet Deck. Because um, TweetDeck is my Twitter client of choice, and better TweetDeck really makes it look good. Um, it's an extension for Firefox and all Chrome stroke Chromium browsers. Talking of browsers, Firefox came back to me and asked me to do a profile record. Um, I don't know if it's done anything. There were a number of Firefox updates this week. Um, haven't had much effect on my desktop and I'm still having issues on various laptops. Um, although only under Windows. Mac, 
fine. But what can you do? Anyway, um, Tuesday, my own mushrooms, my red Duke of York, chipped lettuce and mint, all from the garden. My tomatoes, well, they have little tomatoes there, but they're still green. And I would imagine with the sun today, they might start to turn red. It's really great coming home from work and you just pick food from the garden and eat it. And there you go. Yeah, I really like the lettuce. <laughs> Actually, um, there's going to be bacon rolls cooked out in the back garden. Trandia, thank you. And maybe a burger or two with some lettuce and some onions. I'm talking about my summer onions. Some of them are nearly ready. Anyway, back to beer. Um, I was supposed to be going to Exeter at the end of June. And one of the places I was going to do was going to do, going to go to was the Pursuit of Hoppiness on Facebook this week. It's closed and it will never open, which is a shame because I really enjoyed that place. However, there's one in Bridport and that's still open. So I will be paying a visit because I've never been there before. And there was a tale of woe from the hop bunker. They bought a shed load of beer in for the Wales Scotland Rugby International in March. That got cancelled, so they couldn't sell that. Then there was the lockdown. Then there was water flooding in there, and they've only got one way in and out because it's underground. I feel really sorry for them because I like the hop bunker. It has some great beers in there. And it's a shame. And I think possibly um, what with them and the pursuit of happiness we're going to lose a lot of excellent beer places ah, right um read it pre-covid posting all every day uh, no karma no karma no karma now i'm up to 1500 karma points I'm not sure why, um, but I'm enjoying it. And I post, generally speaking, to the Daily Tech News Show group, those of the face mask, <laughs> which came all the way from, well, the show comes from Los Angeles. These came from Virginia. And shout out to all my Virginia beer friends. And um, time. Time has just shot past. I mean, March to now has just disappeared. And I need to, well, I need to book my car in for a major service and an MOT. My MOT uh, runs out the, the end of August. And I really need a service. I really need to get away as well. But there you go. Um, And finally, went to Tesco's last night and bought some beer and some bread and some, well, fertilizer from a garden and things like that the one-way system has disappeared the queuing to get up system has disappeared there was a blog coming a go at the lack of consistency about where you queue to get to the tills Can't honestly say i blame him but hey give these people a little bit of slack they've been coming in since this has been going on and um, we need supermarkets we need local shops we need Need everything. So uh, that's it for this week. Um, big fluffy white clouds, some sun, nice and warm, and there's a bacon roll approaching. I'm happy. A little bit drunk as well, but what can you do? Anyway, um, thank you very much for watching. And that spiky thing in the background, that's my Asus router. Take care, stay safe, and let's be quite honest, despite what the Welsh Government say, you might want to consider getting a mask. Bye-bye.